Okay, guys, welcome back to the channel, man. Appreciate y'all dialing in, man. Loan me a little bit more of your time, man. This is OG Trip. Listen, man, I've uh, been having some problems, you know, today, you know, with my bracket right here for my copywriter. And the problem I was having is that I really couldn't get enough threads down uh, into the head right here uh, to keep that secure without the vibration knocking these plates off, you know, for more, you getting more air in. So I could be riding somewhere and I stop and I look and I look for stuff like that. You see that? I'll look for that. Or uh, even like this right here. You see that? Let me give you a close. See that? That tells me that damn thing is leaking. Okay? Yesterday I was riding and uh, we pulled over and uh, goes to show. That son bitch was leaking, okay? So this is the fix for it. And the problem is that I went from a 42 millimeter uh, Makuni copperator to a 48 millimeter Makuni copperator, uh, which comes with its own intake all to itself. You know, it's a bigger intake, uh, bigger intake. Bigger copperator, bigger everything, okay? On the setup that I'm running now. This is the setup that I had, okay? Here's the intake. That's the stock uh, Evo style intake, okay? Uh, that's what it looks like. But the one I got on there now, the ports that's feeding the heads are this big from here to here, you know? They that big, not that small. They that big going into the head, and then the one coming out of the head is this size and a half. So, uh, that, that's what I'm dealing with, man. So, after I changed all that over, of course, the bracket right here, which is called a, you know, copperator bracket, was too small. So, I took and put this debriever tube behind this plate, which set that plate out, and I made it work like that for a little while, right? But... I that came back yesterday and came off. I said, man, I'm gonna fix this. But everybody got a back orders on this part that I need, which is this bracket for a 48 millimeter uh Makuni copperator. So what I did is I, I went on and I cut it right here. See that? I cut that right there. And I put me a, a half inch, half up of an inch. That's how much more I needed. In between it and weld both of them together, okay? half inch both of them together on both sides which made this longer and now guys look at it that's perfect it's gonna hold that copperator right up there in place and look how much more thread i got to screw down in there uh put some loctite on that guys put some blue loctite on that and screw it in make sure you got your washers in because that's the little trick to it it's got one wash on the head one right here after the bolt and one right here so it's three washes, it's a total of six washes, three on both sides, okay? Get those washes in there, get them lined up. Now all I got to do uh, is to go ahead and uh, put my uh, Loctite on them, go in and lock these down. Uh, I've got this right here sticking in there because I'm holding my gasket. You know, I have a gasket right here. Uh, it'll hold itself basically when you tie it, when you tie it up, when I bolt it up, but... I just got it sitting right there. I'm not hurting anything. Just letting it sit there. So when I tighten it up, when I pull it together, it'll pull that gasket up too, okay? And that'll keep any kind of air leak that I got, that'll, that'll knock that out, okay? Uh, I probably won't put this stack back up there, okay? Uh, you know, uh, this, this, you know, I was kind of like cocking my legs like a cowboy to mash my back brakes anyway so I'm gonna do away with that uh, because I can pull enough air in it with this can in Arlen uh air filter okay uh, you look straight up through it I can look straight through it see that guys that's a good demonstration right there look you know that thing pulling some air from the front and the back look at that so I should be able to pull enough air in without that extra plate I'll at least try it. If I need it, I can always come back and get it. Okay? All right, man. So, uh, this is a, a compromise, uh, a fix for a copperator bracket. 
uh, 42 millimeter to 48 millimeter this is the fix you have to add a plate in between it if you cannot get it from drag specialists or zipper or any one of those other guys out there that all of them hollering this is on back order this plate and you know the seasons are changing so we are doing a little bit more riding now than we were uh, before the season started to change you know so I don't want to be out on the road uh, you know because I don't you know have the right thing so I'm gonna go ahead and fix this now man and zip it on up and 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 that's gonna be that all right okay guys uh, give me two thumbs up man give me this one and give me that one and then give me that till next time